StarChart is a VR application for viewing the night sky, an astronomy application, so available on mobile phones. But in VR, you get the opportunity to explore the planets in 3D, go around the solar system, view anything from Jupiter to the rings of Saturn, Mars, and the landing site of the Apollo 11 spaceship. We're in the south of France, a town called Venon, just outside of Grenoble, which is in the Alps, where we've got one of our studios. Escapers Games is the company that made StarChart for 10 years. Uh, Future Tech Labs is the company that we've set up off at the back of that. Our other studios are in Norway and in Guildford, just outside of London. Astronomy is something that we all have deep down in our hearts. I think the idea that we could take that and convert it into something you could actually experience in VR was so powerful that we had to make StarChart for VR. The traditional star chart experience is holding your phone up to the night sky so that you can get a window into the night sky, understand the stars, the constellations, and the planets you'd see up there. With VR, we have that experience. It's called Skyview. In Skyview, you look up at the night sky, you can point at a planet, a star, and you can pull it down to your hand and look at it. From there, you can travel out to the planets, travel out and stand in front of the planet, look at it floating from above. When making StarChart for VR, we had to decide to rebuild the application from the ground up. Whether it's the depth and the distance between stars, or whether it's how you make a planet look beautiful in VR when you can go up close to it and stand in front of it. Those were all things that involved a lot of effort and rewriting the application. One of the unique elements of StarChart is the fact that everything has been built to scale. NASA have spent a lot of time and money developing fantastic technologies that show photos of deep sky nebulas or information about the planets and the moons and their trajectories. We've taken all of that data, we've put it into StarChart. The distances are all real, the scales of the planets are all real, and the size of the solar system is all real. This has all been calculated in minute detail within the application. We spent a lot of time and effort making sure that the constellations are beautiful. We've remastered them from the original etchings of Johannes Hevelius, a 16th century astronomer. We've tried to recreate the exact landing spot of the Apollo 11 spaceship so that when you stand on the moon, you're looking at the spaceship on one side, you're looking at the flag, the American flag on the other, you're seeing the Earth rise in front of you, and you've got the various instruments that NASA placed on the moon's surface there around you. We brought StarChart to the Vive Focus. We love the idea of getting StarChart out to as many people as possible through the mobile devices. We've seen much more adoption across mobile. I think we now have about 500,000 users of StarChart in mobile VR. So we entered StarChart into the Vive Port Developer Awards and we were massively chuffed to see that StarChart won. It's great to see finally a little bit of recognition that isn't just consumers downloading the app, but industry recognition for the effort and the work. StarChart's available on the HTC Vive and the Vive Focus on Viveport.